Welcome to the Federal Aviation Administration's Community Education Video Series. This video provides an overview of the FAA's ongoing initiatives to modernize the national airspace system. Communities near airports may notice changes to air traffic routes and aircraft noise. When this happens, people often ask why anything needed to change. In the past, aircraft flew point-to-point -point by passing over ground-based navigational aids. The FAA is replacing ground-based navigational procedures with satellite-based procedures that allow more flexible use of the airspace and provide more direct routing between cities. Direct flight paths may reduce the exposure to noise and emissions. Satellite-based procedures are safer, more precise, and can accommodate the increased demand for air traffic. Performance-based navigation, or PBN, procedures use satellite signals and GPS waypoints to navigate aircraft from one point to another with more accuracy and precision. PBNs direct routes and idle power descents improve fuel efficiency and may reduce flight time, noise, and engine emissions. Time-based management, or TBM, builds on the PBN foundation. To get the maximum benefit of these new satellite-based technologies, the FAA is developing new data exchange systems that assist air traffic controllers with managing air traffic flows. Much like how freeway on-ramp lights meter the entry of cars onto the freeway to maintain a consistent flow of traffic without overloading the freeway, TBM technologies will assist controllers with metering aircraft as they fly through the NAS. This will ensure that airspace capacity is used efficiently without placing too much air traffic in one area at the same time. TBM metering maintains a steady, manageable flow of air traffic by sequencing aircraft to avoid congestion. Growing demand for air transportation, including passengers, cargo, and new types of aircraft like drones and air taxis, requires a sophisticated, advanced airspace system. In the early 2000s, rather than slightly upgrading an aging infrastructure, the FAA began implementing major changes to increase the safety, efficiency, capacity, predictability, and resiliency of American aviation. Modernization isn't only about technology. Having ongoing, open conversations with the community is critical to the process. The Reauthorization Act of 2018 advanced the effort further with legislative measures to manage aircraft noise. The Act requires a regional ombudsman to work with a regional administrator to support each FAA region in the United States and serve as a liaison with the public on air traffic issues, including noise, pollution, and safety. The ombudsman brings community concerns and input back to the FAA and ensures the public is notified of major federal action. A modernized NAS provides flexibility, precision, and predictability for safe and efficient operations. The FAA remains committed to working with communities and other stakeholders to ensure there's early and meaningful dialogue on these issues. For more information on this topic, visit faa.gov noise. You can submit questions to our interactive chatbot or contact your regional administrator and or regional noise ombudsman.